Hey everybody, so do something a little different. I'm gonna unbox something. This is like a big deal, right? Unboxing. This is a CCPT modular power tool organizer with built-in eight outlet power strip. And then there's some shorter Chinese writing. Kind of looks like this. I'm gonna end up putting it over there moving those shelves and hanging them on the wall so all my power, all my electric tools can be organized in one place. I just found this on Amazon. It, I bought it with my own money. This isn't me promoting anything. I'm just curious. And if it's any good, well, uh, you know, I can say, hey, go out and get this. So what we're going to do is unbox it, take a look at all the parts. I'm going to install it. And then we're going to take a look at it when it's done. All right, so I've cut cut it open. I'll slide this all out. And okay, box. Another box. Okay, so here's the trays. So here's the side pieces. They're numbered one and two. That's kind of neat. Okay. Um, foam, garbage. Okay, so these are the trays. And they're, oh, good, they have like little, they have small holes in them. And it gives you part number three. Uh, this is part number, part number four. And part number three. Cool stuff. And then in here, Get my trusty razor blade. Okay, we got oh, the power outlet, the built in power outlet. There's that. Ooh, pretty heavy duty, bolts down. Two, four, six, eight. Wow, that will give me a lot more capacity over here. Very excited over that. And uh, I guess this is all the hardware. Oh, a thing to organize screwdrivers, drill bits, bunch of hooks, and nuts and bolts. And then number five and seven. That's pretty cool. All right. And here's the uh, instructions. I guess I'll use these. Well, it's actually fairly simple. Cool. The hardest part's going to be moving all that around and then finding a place on the wall to mount this because there's studs in this wall are garbage. Well, cool. All right. So uh, let me start installing it, putting this together and installing it, and then we'll take a look at what it looks like when it's done. Cool. You know, um, hey, if you've had something like this or have a different solution that you take hey, comment, Show a picture of it below. That'd be kind of neat because uh, this is just neat stuff trying to organize my tiny little garage. Hopefully, hopefully uh, I'll move and I can take this with me and have space because that's what the final frontier, isn't it? All right, so we'll move on and do it. Well, I assembled it. It took like 15 minutes. They give you um, this... Uh, yeah, right here. Give it this Allen key, which is cute. It's not bad, but there aren't that many of them. But then I end up using a little uh, electric screwdriver with an Allen key bit to find it, finish it up. Uh, they also give you, you know, all the bolts. These are the bolts and stuff to make two, connect two of them together. They give you a silly wrench and uh, some extra, you know, extra screws, which is nice. And these are the bolts to put them together. So a lot of stuff you just have to save because you don't use it now. Pretty, uh, all in all, so far, not so bad. Kind of lays out nice, feels sturdy, um, doesn't take a lot of space, but it looks like it could store a bunch of things. So we'll uh, get this installed now. So we unboxed our CCCI Power Tool Organizer the other day. And I uh, assembled it. It took 15 minutes. 
And uh, once again, it's not a paid program, paid thing. This is something I just found on a whim, discounted on Amazon, and like, okay, this could be quite helpful. I put it together in 15 minutes. They give you an Allen key and all. You can kind of, you know, it's not many bolts. Really, really, really neat. But here it is. It fits in there kind of nice. I was actually able to save one of the little drawers. The other drawer I put over where I have my big cabinet. I put it over there. I have a big cabinet of, uh, behind all the crap. There's a big cabinet with uh, all sorts of stuff in it. And I put the little drawer hung it on the wall. So in case I need any little parts for there. Uh, you know, but I'm still working on the organization. I got it pretty, pretty well. So up here is one of my Dremel chargers and that fits. This is a uh, flashlight that charges solar. These are my drill bits. I kind of stuck them there. These are little attachments for this little skill screwdriver. The skill screwdriver right here. And my batteries. Uh, and I have my dr the, 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 the drivers down here and, and the drill. I got one of my air impacts over here that I don't use very often. This is a really old single hammer one. But it, it's rather nice. It has the good storage on the side. That I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to figure out how to work, but I can put my since it's metal, I can hang my uh, my flashlight there. I put my my USBs, my cables in there, and also I can tuck them in here. Because I'm not really gonna put drill bits in here. I have a couple, but see I can kind of tuck everything out of the way. And you can join these together to give you um, this little bit of these little parts here. This is to put another unit together. That's what that's for to, if you buy multiples. So hopefully if I can get a, a bigger space. And of course I can bring these with me and, you know, have them really on, on a wall and have this so everything's hanging. But I, I like, I just like the, how easy this put together, how simple it was. And, you know, its footprint is pretty small for the amount of stuff you can stick on there, which is pretty good. So I've, I'm gaining back some space because this is it's honestly in, in any garage, I don't care how big it is, uh, space becomes a prior, uh, like a, a luxury. So this is one of those things you can go out, the CCCEI -C -C Power Tool Organizer. It was uh, really a good thing. I got a good deal on it. And uh, so hopefully if you guys see this out there and it's marked down, because this was marked down like over 50%, grab it. Don't even, don't even question about it. It is a very good product. So with that, thank you very much for watching. If you got anything from this, you know, comment, like it, subscribe. And of course, I will have some more car content coming out. Lots of car content coming up. And uh, as always, you have a cool old classic car or something fun, take it out and you'll make someone's day, maybe even your own. I'll catch you down the road.